Hey, good to see you. Have you, have you ever wondered how some people have the ability to really build strong connections? I mean, there's some horse people out there, they have that, that certain thing and they connect with horses. It's, it's amazing. You watch them and it's like, <laughs> God, how do they do that? You, you just get goosebumps watching them. You know, and then you ask yourself, how does he do that? How does she do that? Just to make everything look so pretty, so beautiful, so much in the flow. And you don't see any, you don't see any like intimidation. You don't see force. You don't see manipulation. It just all, it all flows. It's like horses, the horse and the person, they're just one. And it's, it's so beautiful to watch. And there's also some people out there who have that same bond with other people, you know, they, they, they radiate some certain energy and, and draw people in and you just wonder, how do they do that? Now, I want to tell you a story. The first time I've ever seen somebody building such a strong connection was 1990 in Oregon. And uh, I was actually uh, supposed to meet up with my mentor. And I didn't even know that he was going to be my mentor. It turned out later on that he was going to take me under his wing. And uh, so that was the first day I was supposed to meet him. We didn't have internet, so I didn't even know how it looked like. So I just pulled in to his, to his barn and I, I just walked into the indoor arena, right? And I, um, I, just, I just peeked in there because the door was open. And I saw this tall guy sitting on a horse. And I figured, well, that must be Don, right? And, and it was. And I watched him. And it was so, so fascinating. And it touched me so deep. He was, he was just kind of walking his horse around, really easy. And it was not just somebody sitting on a horse. He was doing something else. And you could tell that the two had a very strong connection and uh, like the ears of the horse were just going back and forth and that horse was really relaxed and um, so Don he just uh, he just saw me and he said hey uh, you must be Mickey right and he, he apologized he said uh, I, I'm sorry I, I know I'm supposed to meet you but I'm running a little bit late I just have to finish this horse she just needs to cool down a little bit more and I said, hey, don't, don't worry if, if I can just watch you, you know. And he said, yeah, fine, you just come on in and just sit on the fence and you'll be fine. And I did, and I watched him. And while he was riding the horse, he said, you know, she's, she's pretty hot-blooded. She's very, very nervous. And uh, she takes a lot of time. But he said, one day, you're going to win some buckles on her. You're going to beat somebody's butt. She's that good. But she just needs to settle down. Isn't she pretty? Oh, I just love her. That's what he said. That's what he said. And when he said that, he, he was just stroking her on the neck. And it was like, oh gosh, it was, this guy was having a love affair with his horse. And I could feel it. It was so beautiful. And, um, from then on, I stayed with him for a couple of years and uh, I could see that he had love affairs everywhere. You know, with every horse he was riding, he was having a love affair. And he, he actually told me, he said, you got to have an affinity with your horse. And, um, and then it was like the horses were loving him back, really. And, and I, was, I loved him because he was, so, he was so open, so gentle, so forgiving. And um, that just really drew me in. So what I just want to say is when, when we want to have a deep connection to animals and to people, then it's like we have to love it first with everything, all the crappy stuff like Don was doing. You have to love it first and then there's, there's no limit and then you get so much back. It's, it's amazing. And um, yeah, I just, I just wanted to share that with you because it touched me really. I could, I almost cried when I saw it because it was it came from such a deep place. It was so emotional to watch. So uh, this is what I'm really after. I, I want 
I want to get that deep connection and um, because it's so beautiful. So um, thank you very much for watching.